are you guys hope you're doing well i am going to be speaking in this tone of voice because everyone in my house is sleeping as you guys know i am a mom of three and i don't want to wake anyone up so <laughs> i'm going to be speaking like i'm afraid of waking up someone anyway i want to introduce you guys to the little magical creature we adopted last week i know if you're following me on instagram you have seen our new demi guys say hi isn't he the cutest freaking thing <laughs> we got him last week um this is from the novel collection i got him from amazon i was looking to finish my fantastic beast shell and he is just perfect i didn't like brush or comb his tail but he comes being a little bit of a mess and you just and you can bend him, you can just brush his hair, and you can bend him whenever way you want. Let me see if I can focus on his face. <gasps> Hello. Okay, so that's it for Demi, guys. So I have seen these nerdy ink dust jackets before. I thought it was like a published official Harry Potter series, but it isn't, it's dust jackets. I bought, as you guys know, let me see, I have the hardcover prints um, from years ago, and I just bought a second set to put these dust jackets. I hope this is not hard to open. So I've seen them all over Instagram for a while, and uh, someone mentioned that Nerdy Ink was doing another, it was like a third run of these dust jackets, and I jumped on it as fast as I could. They sold out. Um, I think a lot of people have been asking, and if I am not mistaken, um, the owner mentioned that she was gonna have some extras that she was gonna sell during the fall. So just follow Nerdy Inc. They're on Instagram. They're a family-owned small shop. You guys know I love to support. This is, this is all post notice. Um, Hogsmeade, Old Post, Nerd Ink, Fear to be Infected. Okay, this is cool. Let me just show you. So these, I'm going to be covering my books with this. This is for the Philosopher's Stone. Here is the one for Prisoner of Azkaban. You can see Sirius, Crookshins, Hermione with her Time Turner. It's this mischief mismanage. Uh, I love the detail and like it has one special item from each movie. Something that was like iconic from each movie. Um, the first one is Hedwig and you can see the letter and the saucer Stone. I was like, I'm not sure this real quick. No, I want to take my time. So this is the one from the Chamber of Secrets. I don't want to like break them. Okay, so you got um, the sorting head. It says, enemies of the air, beware. It has whole words. It has genie with the diary. And it has Nagini, or not Nagini, um, the basilisk. Yes, probably the basilisk. Ah, I don't know. It has also Molly's hollow. So I'm here like, it cannot be... Nagini because she doesn't show up until later on, but it's a little bit thin to be a basilisk. Anyway <laughs> This is the one for the chamber of secrets Let me show you the one for The goblet of fire Oh my gosh, She's just so cute. So this is my first time seeing them in person So I'm like geeking over them while at the same time showing you guys. So it has again Howard's castle it says where's the fun without a bit of risk and it has you know see the golden egg right here and the goblet of fire so that's the fourth one <gasps> okay we have made it to my favorite one it's luna's book no it's the order of phoenix but you know it's the first time luna shows up on the series so you got the prophecy right there you got the Thestral, and in the back it says, you are just as sane as I am. I hope my camera, like, I'm able to show this right, yeah. You guys, I cannot wait to put these in the books and just 
show you. I'm going to show you later on like my favorite items from my collection. I don't think I'm gonna like rank them or anything, but just to show you which one are like my favorite ones. And if I ever have fire, which ones I'm picking up first. No, I'm just kidding. I'm picking up my kids first. Anyway, I'm going to show you guys later on and these are definitely gonna be like put it on the books and show you how they look together. So this is half broth prints. You can see the Felix Felix is there. You can see, come on camera. Let me see what it says. It says, luck can only get you so far. Like, oh, love them, love these colors. And last but not least, we have Harry Potter and the Deadly Hallows. Um, it has a beautiful Patronus here and it says until the very end <laughs> okay how oh, beautiful are these so that's it i am raising my tone of voice because <laughs> my husband came and he's like we're all awake so i'm good to go i can just talk however i want so let me place these real carefully here <laughs> and show you guys the next thing that arrived so as you guys know, I have all the Harry Potter and Fantastic Beasts pops ever released. It's like the only collection of pops that I have ever completed and intend to complete because it's a lot. So I had these as soon as it came out in Hot Topic and I remember they end up selling like for six bucks, which is basically what I paid for. Um, so I got them back then and okay. So I got them back then and come on. Oh, there you go. So you see it has a beautiful Thestral and Grindelwald. It's supposed to be like a movie moment from when he escapes in Crimes of Grindelwald. So I separated this two from the base back then and I have displayed them and not right now they're in my Fantastic Beast shelves. I have displayed them without the base basically just fine but from time to time when I'm rearranging things it pisses me off for those of you that wants to take them out of the base it's totally fine it's just that the test roll won't stay standing like I gotta lean him on on something and I just wanted to just have it and be able to display it I'm probably just gonna put the test roll back by Luna's side and put this one on the Fantastic Beast shelf so that's it for this one I received from box lunch this um frame it's a four by six and i feel it's gonna look amazing on my wall i am so excited to finally have a wall that i can just put all the wall art that i want um i should have brought a scissor with me or something no i'm not that strong okay heavy okay it comes with this little hangers if you want to put it on the wall but it also comes with this if you don't want to damage your walls i love when people give you the option because sometimes it just comes for you want to put it on the wall and it just comes with this or sometimes it just doesn't have the hard wire for you to hang it on the wall so this one has both look at the detail on this thing isn't it amazing i love it so much so I actually printed this picture. If you have followed me on Instagram, you know that I have shown this picture of my husband and I. This was back in 2018 um, in front of the Hogwarts Castle in the Western World in Universal. So I printed it and I'm probably gonna put it right here. And just, we're also the, are actually planning of going again um, in August. So maybe I'll take a picture with our robes in front of the Hogwarts Castle. Maybe that's what's gonna go here. I don't know, for now, it's gonna be this one. I'm gonna show you guys later on as soon as, I'm probably gonna show a video of the whole wall, like every art and where I got it from. So stay tuned for that. I do have it on my Instagram, like a little highlight that says wall art. So if you're feeling curious, you can go there and check. Another thing that arrived from Box Lunch is this Privet Drive um, symbol. For the record, I hate opening things on camera because I always take so long. So I usually have things open already before I start um, recording myself because, you know, 
I don't know. Do you guys have the patience to see me open up this? <laughs> Ta-da! It's not that bad. Stop being dramatic. It's a pretty bit dry. Ah! So cool. I don't know where I'm gonna hang it, but I saw it on the box lunch slide. I was like, I need this. So there's that. So cute. It's very lightweight. So, oh, talking about not being able to hang things on the wall. It doesn't have anything. We need to hang it on the wall. So, ah, I don't know. I don't know where I want to put it now. Totally disappointed. Anyway, <laughs> moving on. I have these two pins. Wait, I want to show you another thing that arrived from Box Lunch. I got these two pins. Um, thank you to Geek Glitz. If you are not following her on Instagram, you should. She also has an amazing YouTube channel, Geek Glitz. So she uh, posted, she's been posting videos of her Harry Potter collection, like the backpacks and the jewelry and the pins and the pins collection totally inspired me. I was like, this is so beautiful. So I decided to order a couple of pins and Hot Topic had this beautiful, come on, if my camera would focus, that would be great. It probably won't. It probably won't. So. These two pins, this is from Hogwarts and it's like Draco Diamond Snow. It's it's the Hogwarts crest and it looks beautiful. And this one, which is my house, it's from Gryffindor. I'm not quite sure. Come on. I'm not quite sure if it had um, other houses like Slytherin, Ravenclaw, and Hufflepuff, but it had the Gryffindor one and it looks pretty cool. I thought they were gonna be bigger, but in the big scheme of things, I got a lot of pins coming, so I, and I don't have a huge pin board right now. I'm gonna have an eight by 10 um, cork board. I caught it and put it on a black frame. So that's what I'll be using, so I guess more space for more pins. So this book, I bought it from Mercari. It's a hardcover. It's pretty minty like i said it's in great condition i don't obviously it has a little bit of bending here but it's harry potter y la cámara secreta which is the spanish version of harry potter and the chamber of secrets and i used to read these books i am raised in i was raised in puerto rico so um my first language is spanish as you guys must know by now <laughs> so I want to collect all these books, but they range between like 30 and even 50 bucks if you want them hardcover. So finding this one was 16 bucks. I was like, yes, I'm gonna, I like to just get things together at the same time. Like I don't buy things one by one. I don't have that much self-control. So getting this book, it's, it's gonna be a test of my patience because now I gotta wait to find other deals on the other six, but I'm going to do it because I feel having this Harry Potter book series in Spanish is, it's, you know, it's part of me. That's my first language. It's how I read the books for the first time. God knows it wasn't in English. So yes, <laughs> I love having this and I'm very, very happy. Also, I know there are cheaper versions of the Spanish books, but these are like the original illustration that I first got in the cover when I was like in eighth grade. So it matters to me. So I got this pillow. It's not Harry Potter pillow, but it's, a pillow that I got in Amazon for like 10 bucks for this cover. So if you guys have seen the Pottery Barn, um, I'm showing it. Ta -da! Okay, so Pottery Barn Teen has a beautiful Harry Potter collection and this Expecto Patronum um, cover is from their line. I also got my golden egg. It's a jewelry like holder, a necklace holder, and it opens. It's from Pottery Barn, but it's sold out, and it's so, so hard to find. Like, um, you can never see it on eBay or Mercari. That's why the night that I saw that listing, by the time I saw it, it was like in five people's carts. So I just got it as fast as I could. <gasps> oh my goodness. This is a beautiful, beautiful pillow cover. It says Expecto Patronum, and it was like $39 on Potty Barn Teen. Um, they sell it for $61 if you want um, the insert, like the pillow insert already, but my guess is you can just go to Amazon and pay 10 bucks for it and just put it. Hopefully it will fit. If not, if it won't fit, I will let you guys know on Instagram and just buy it directly from Potty Barn with the pillow inside. This I got from Box Lunch. I used to have this back in 2016. I used to 
have a nursery dedicated to Harry Potter with my second baby being born, before my second baby was born. Um, and this used to be on the floor, like a carpet. Um, but late, later we changed that room to now my mother-in-law's at, so it's not Harry Potter anymore. So I didn't have need for this. So, but I was very happy to see that there was like a throw in box lunch available. The one that I used to have was way thinner than this one. This one is like thicker. And I guess it's like a throw blanket I can just slip on here. So, oh my goodness. Okay, you won't see me for a second. Did you guys saw it? Isn't it beautiful? So, <laughs> I'm still deciding where I'm gonna put this one. Probably in my couch. My couch that is right in front of my collection. This is like a living room. It It's kind of ugly. So, I'm just gonna cover it with like Harry Potter stuff to make it seem magical. This is gonna play a big part on it. So, I'm just gonna throw it in my couch for now. Next, I got from Oh My Goodness Pins. I'm gonna show you all the pins. I'm gonna be receiving some pins this week. This beautiful pin from It's Hagrid. Okay, isn't it the cutest thing? And But it's not just Hagrid. It says, I am what I am and I am not ashamed. So yes, oh my goodness, pins. Beautiful, beautiful. And she has a Molly uh, pin that says, um, I don't remember what it says, but it's a Molly pin and it's up for pre-order and it's beautiful and I cannot wait because you guys know I love Molly and you ask me what's my favorite character from Harry Potter series. It's Molly, okay? Because, you know, I want to have also a ton of kids. I love my husband a lot. So I just identify. Uh, these ones are from Laser Brain Patch Co. Look at the beautiful Howard's illustration. So I have bought from her before and these pins do not disappoint. They're beautiful, beautiful. I used to have one, there's a picture of it on my Instagram. It says, we all have light and um, darkness inside us, which is Sirius Black's quote. And it had like Sirius as a dog with the quote inside. Beautiful pin. Uh, that's from her. And uh, the Hogwarts castle with like the rainbow color sky. That's the one that I have right now. Ooh, okay. How beautiful is that? It's Buckbeak and the Time Turner. Yes. Let me see if I can just load. Okay. And then what we have here, it's Howard. I wanted to have something dedicated. Like I don't want to have a thousand pins of Harry and a thousand pins of Dobie and a thousand pins for each movie. I just want to have like one single pin of each movie or moment or character so you know this to represent quidditch this is pretty perfect it has the golden snitch it has i think it's harry flying on the broom how cool is this like sorry i'm i am not an avid pin collector so showing pins is not my specialty not that i show anything else on a very professional manner but isn't this cute so let me see that I'm not missing anything else of that what I have received. No, that's it for now. I am very, very excited to put all these things into my shelves. I think that's one of the most funniest things that are the more entertaining things to do. It's just rearranging stuff to make things fit. A lot of people always ask me like, oh, what do you do when you run out of space? And like, I rearrange, which also breaks a lot of things, which is sad. But yeah, be careful when you rearrange stuff on your shelves. I'm going to probably show you guys next week my favorite items from uh, my collection. And you will be able to see the nerdy ink dust jackets on the books. So thank you so much for watching. I'm like looking around making sure because it's like, okay, bye-bye. And then I'm like, oh my God, I didn't show you them this. <laughs> thank you so much for watching. I have nothing but love for you guys. And if you haven't, subscribe to the channel. I I never say that. It's funny because people, I see other YouTubers and they're like, subscribe to my channel. And I'm like, do, do I'm supposed to be saying that? I don't know, you guys. I am the kind of person that I forget to subscribe to videos that I really enjoy. So I'm guessing you might be too. So I'm here to remind you, <laughs> subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be putting a lot of cute couple um, like videos 
to show you Disney stuff and more Harry Potter stuff that I have and different changes that I'm doing to this room. So hopefully I'll be able to show you like a full room tour soon as well. So if you want to get the notification when I upload that, subscribe. Boom. Here you go. <laughs> Stay blessed, you guys. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.